Hello ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, pizza fans of all ages. My name is Mike and welcome to Pizza Mom Mario and welcome to episode 1 of season 2 of my Nicktoons Unite Saga Let's Play as we are now going to play Nicktoons Battle for Volcano Island. So real quick, before we start this, for anyone who hasn't watched the Nicktoons Unite portion of the LP, I would recommend watching that first before you watch this. Just so it can be up to date with the Nicktoons Unite series and all that. The link to the full playlist will be in the description below, so I recommend going to watch that first and then coming back to this. As for the rest of you, let's go ahead and get into this. So let's not waste any more time and y'all take a seat, get comfortable, grab your snacks and your beverages, and let's get started. Start a new game, and I'm gonna skip all this until we get to the opening cutscene because. Just like the first game, it takes a while to save and load. So I'll see you guys in a second. Okay, I lied. I actually skipped to- Shut up, car! I actually skipped to where we uh, get to see Spongebob floating in the background. Okay, here's the opening cutscene. You can camp. There are many dangers on our island. You must defend yourself. Okay, so there are going to be some tutorial parts coming up, so I may not be able to talk for the first couple minutes. So you have to bear with me here. Fire missiles, but I'm firing balloons. Uh, balloons. Bubbles. Why did I say balloons? Shoo those birds away. Those are the weirdest looking birds I've ever seen. They're like like weird looking flamingos. I guess. Yes, I will. Yeah, so all of these uh, seashells we're picking up, as you can see down there, we need to collect all, all those, and when we do, we unlock uh, SpongeBob's alternate costume. And also, over here, we have SpongeBob's giant pearl. As it says there, collect all four of his items to unlock a bonus level. Each character has their own uh, bonus level and costume, which I, and I'll show all those off in this LP, so... Yeah. Look out! One of those guards burns! Eh, no problem. 
These birds are, are no better, are no easier to take out than the Goombas from the first game. So right off the bat, I will say the gameplay in this game is is improved over the first game. Like for one thing, while the first game's gameplay was kind of sluggish, the gameplay here is more uh, fast paced. And plus there's a double jump feature, which is, which is really great. And each character has their own melee and projectile uh, attack. Although as you, as you can see from, from the top where SpongeBob's icon is, when you use one, yeah, then it takes away a bar. And when you lose them all, you can't use an attack. And also the characters have dialogue during the gameplay. Which is a nice uh, touch, by the way. And the, where it says why there, don't worry about that. That's just, that's just a tutorial. Yeah. Ooh, that shark. Bird. I sprayed a lot of birds and turned them into coins in Mario Sunshine. So, I know how to take care of birds. So, how are y'all doing on this lovely day? Hope you're doing okay. That's not really a lovely day where I am. It's actually pretty bad outside. It's all gloomy and ugh. Did he say nut? No. No problem. How do I throw it? Oh, ow. He said what's up for the boom for a reason. I'm gonna go up here. Get this. It's SpongeBob's twirl move. Wait, is there anything down here I need to know about? There's some stuff. Ow, ow, ow. Gotta collect as many of these seashells as possible. Or salvage items, as the game calls it. If I say these are seashells. That's literally what they are. They're seashells. Okay, can I stop saying the word seashells, please? Yeah, so unlike the first game where we went to to characters different universes. Universes? Does that even make sense? No. The whole, the whole game takes place here on Volcano Island. So, yeah. Don't expect to see Emmy Park or Bikini Bottom at, at any point during the LP because... Not happening. Oh, whoops. Okay, Danny's just gonna stay up there. Wait for me. That's fine. Okay, he left. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. Okay, that help went into the water. It's fine. I didn't need it anyway. Golden seashell. So as you guys know, I'm sure tomorrow is Thanksgiving. We eat lots of turkey. And you know, mashed potatoes and, and cranberry sauce and all that. Oh look, we found Sandy's rocket. I don't know why I thought it was Jimmy's rocket at first. Oh, there might have been a spoiler right there with Sandy's rocket, but whatever. Hey, birds. Birdie. It's in a seashell. Whoa, don't fall. Anything else? Yep. Destroy everything. <gasps> Ghost 
And there's also a, a school bus and an ice cream truck. I haven't seen an ice cream truck fall from the sky. Yeah, so we have drinking paths here. Let's see, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go this way. I'm gonna go both ways, but I'll stop over here. Can I, can I take that out? Oh, I, I guess not. And there's a Plankton's uh, crab robot from the first game. Oh, sorry, Daniel, I didn't mean to hit you. Where's the dialogue? I know there's a dialogue here. Oh, there you go. Yeah. You know what? Should I go the other way now? Wait, hold on. Let me, let me just see if I can... Let me just... There's that, that in the background, it just fell. Oh, bird, 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 bird. Okay, I think I can go down here. Ow. Bird, do you mind? I'm trying to like collect things. And I keep thinking X is the jump, I don't know why. I don't know. Oh, whoops. That was it. Oh, something. Oh, oh. Almost fell. Hey, I gotta get, gotta get this. I don't like those costumes. Oh, here we go. We found Squidward's quiet sign. Collect all four of his items to unlock the art gallery. Again, oh, God dang it, I keep thinking X is the jump. Maybe because X was jumping in the first game. Maybe that's why. I think X was supposed to jump in the first game. That's probably why I'm thinking it's X. Stay out of the deep water. It's dangerous to off-worlders. Yeah. I may have already figured that out, but... Thanks for anyway. Oh, whoa. Look, like was moving on by himself there. Don't get eaten by the shark either. That's not good. Ow. Yeah. Ow, Whoa, whoa, whoa there. The birds barfing on me. Forget, forgot about those. You know, hold on, let's, let's switch to Danny. How do I switch characters? I think R did that, right? R, yeah, R. Might as well show up, up Danny real quick. Oh, okay, can't get over there. Let's give Danny some screen time. Yeah, the game mostly focuses around uh, SpongeBob and Danny. They're like the two main characters, I guess you can say, of this game, which is fine. It's nice to see SpongeBob and Danny interact. Never thought we ever see that. Those monsters are servants of the Margo. Them. No problem. What's what's Danny's projectile weapon? Oh wait, yeah, X, right. He shoots like ectoplasm or something, I don't know. He's just like he just beats the heck out of everybody. <laughs> Little punches. He, he does a, like a like a Cesaro uppercut. Or like a Shoryuken, whatever you want to call it. His run animations looks a lot better in this game too. Jump to get across here. You can jump higher by jumping again when you're in the air. Yeah, I kinda already figured that out, dude. Thank you. Besides, I already played this game, so I already know like for the most part everything about it. 
Yeah. I also like Danny's jump sound effect. I don't know why. It's like, whew. There's something kind of funny about it. Oh yeah, and the slam attack is back from the first game. Ow! Oh wait, hold on, I gotta destroy the thing. Ow! Punk. Um, get the health. Get the health. Get the health. Why are you selling honkies? He's throwing up. Yep, it's Patrick Starr. In this game, we can actually play as him. Hooray! I'm gonna edit, I'm gonna skip all this, by the way. Look at all the, all the shelves he picked up. We got all the salvage items, that's good. And then we're gonna go to Shipwreck Cliff. Climb it through the shipwreck to reach the campsite. Yes, now we have Patrick here. Hey, switch, switch to Patrick. Look at him. You can't cross the water. Okay, yeah. You can't cross the water oh. here, but you can climb. You can jump from one climbing wall to another. All right, thanks for the, for the scoop. Look at how he runs. It's like, <laughs> Wee! Like he looks like a superhero. Yo, did this game predict the episode of uh, Patrick Man? Whoa, whoa. I think these are, these are Danny's uh, pickups. Yeah, I'm pretty sure, whatever they are. What season was Patrick Man? Was that season nine? I want to say it was, but I don't know. I'm not, I don't remember. I'll look it up later. He jumps like, bow, bow. Hard to hear, but he's like, bow, bow. Hey, SpongeBob. Yeah, these are Danny's times. Yeah. Now! Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. What was that? Was that a squeak I just heard? I don't know. Whee! Oh, Danny, you gotta watch out for that. Now, Just collect all this. And Patrick like spins around for his uh, melee attack. Yeah. Let's see what his projectile weapon is. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! I forgot he did that. Okay, so yeah, he does a, like, a cartwheel combo or whatever. <laughs> I was not expecting that. Like I said, I only remember partially some stuff about this game. It's, it's been like, maybe like three years since I played this. Anything back here? I don't know. Do that again. Yeah! Look at him go. I never thought I'd ever see Patrick Cartwheel. I don't recall I remember cartwheeling in the, uh, in the show. I remember in the episode when uh, Squidward, 
he wins he went inside SpongeBob's body and he has arms and legs so he can win a dance competition. Because he didn't qualify for the What's dance. Like? I wonder if we can break it. Like this. And then uh, Patrick at the end won the award for the cramp that he did. That I guess they just assumed it was a dance. That's a Yeah. Not a cartwheel, but it's probably the closest thing, I guess. I might have been called Slimy Dancing, I think that was the episode name. Not to be confused with the I Heart Dancing, which I think is something different. That was the one with the... Uh, when uh, Squilliam was having a dance competition, and, and then like... Or, was that it? Or, I don't know. Let, let me just talk about the game. Well, that was the episode that did have the famous, uh, who put you on a plant, uh, meme. So, yeah. You'll know what episode I'm talking about when you, if I just say that alone. Maybe we can knock it over. Yeah. Okay, answer that question. <laughs> yeah, this thing. Oh wait, there's another item. I don't know. Sandy surfboard. I don't know why I just... I was sending the uh, Starman theme from Mario, but... Oh, where did that bird come from? I swear that wasn't there before. Get over how Patrick runs in this game. Like, I'm Patrick Man. Someone's gotta make like a like a meme of this, this. Oh, get out of my, excuse me, SpongeBob. Where'd Danny go? Ow, ow, ow. Oh, oh, there's Danny. Health, health, power. Yay. Ow. What else we got? Oh, well. Oh. Like oh. Like I love the little dialogue they did in this, in this game. It's a nice touch. Oh, oh, oh. Patrick, cleaning house. I really love the fact that there's a double jump. I'm probably wouldn't be able to make this, these jumps in the first game if we didn't have a double jump. Oh God! Okay, I didn't, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Ah! Okay, that, that happened. Uh, why? Those birds come from. I swear those birds weren't there either. Up there. No, right now. Go over here. I'm just gonna ignore the birds. I'll let them live their lives. Not bothering me. You guys Wait. need air Oh no, I'm not delicate like Spongebob. Hey! 
<laughs> yeah, I like how they made a reference to the first game too. He found Danny's Greenstone Tiki. Collect all four of his items and unlock his bonus level, yeah. I don't remember that from the show, but... I don't know, whatever. I mean, I'm hoping I can get the, the complete se complete season... Complete series on DVD. Because I have that on my Christmas list. I mentioned that in the first game. So hopefully I'll remember the references if I get that. Oh, come on, guys. Don't get in my way. Bird, 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 bird. Birdie, go bye bye. Bye bye, birdie. I don't know what these things are. It might be. Kind of look like wheels of some kind. Whatever. Bird. Bird, ow! There's probably. I want to slam on them with Patrick. Do, do, do. Why? I, I didn't mean to do that. Ah! I don't want to get eaten by the shark. Ah! <laughs> Come on, Patrick. Thank you. I'm not afraid of a big old sand monster. I eat big sand monsters for breakfast. Oh, look over there. We found Patrick's totem pole. <laughs> ow, 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 ow. Oh, right. I forgot he, uh, he turns into sand when uh, you do that, and he has a block. He like barfs out sand. Come on! Yeah, yeah, you big fella. Big, big papa. Come here, you. Feel the might of Patrick! Golden shell. Anything else around here? SpongeBob just glitched through the floor there. Another one of these things to destroy. Ow, 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 ow. No, no stop. Don't change your, your target. Look over here. Don't hurt SpongeBob. SpongeBob herders. Nice digs. down here and I can't go down there. Gotta look everywhere for secrets. How do I get up there? Like, I guess I should set the... Duh. <laughs> I think I need to use a. Uh... Oh, never mind. I, I, I thought I had to use a projectile weapon. It's Patrick's projectile weapon is not really a projectile weapon. Oh, now we have new enemies. We have crabs! Wait, hold on. Let me use. Yeah! <laughs> Rolling around at the speed of sound. Starfish first, because Patrick's going on first. If it just said sea creatures first, it wouldn't make any sense. Well, I mean, not that starfish and, and sponges don't, don't, whatever. Yeah. 
Climb, Patrick. I probably could just go over the other way. Cause oh God. <laughs> so I'll probably go over this way just because there's some stuff there. Oh, I can't go back? Wait, I, I can't go back? If I switch to Danny, I can go back. No, switch, switch to Danny. Switch to Danny! Sorry, sorry, sorry. Alright, there we go. Oh, oh, no! Danny! Get back up there. No, no, Danny, get- don't- don't glitch through it, get up there. Oh, come on! I, I, I seriously can't get back up there? Maybe if I jump on Patrick's head, I can get up there. Oh, that is so lame! I, I can't get back up there! Oh, whoop, whoop, whoop. <laughs> That's messed up. Fine, whatever, I won't go back up there then. Okay, get on that boat. Thank you. They can... No, I'm not even gonna try that. You over here? Nope. <laughs> Why are they no way back down here? Oh yeah, you can also jump up the uh, ropes here. Ow! Get off me! Hey, Dan, look healthy here. It's my friend Tucker. He's size TV dinners cornered. Don't worry, Tucker. We'll get you out of there. I'm using the last one, but now yet. You know what I mean. Yeah, that confirms that actually is bird barf. Oh, oh god, I'm taking a lot of damage. <laughs> look, at, look at Patrick's icon. Like, stop hurting me! Hey, give me that health. I needed that. Give me this health too. Oh. Okay, just fell out of the sky. That's. Oh, that's fine, I guess. Fall out of the sky. See if I care. Thanks, guys. Hey, what's going on? Long story, pal. I'll tell you once the sky shows us where to camp. So, we're hanging out with a sponge, a starfish, and a crab. Yeah, we're the Chosen Ones! Right here is your new home, Chosen Ones. See that pool? It is a shrine to the powers for good. Hmm. Nice place. Yeah, unfortunately, even though Tucker is, is in this game, we can't play as him. He's a non-playable character. It's kind of messed up. It would be nice to be able to play as him, but... Oh well. What stuff we got? Oh no, we I missed a spatula. I have to go back and get that. I'll probably go get go get that off screen. I don't, I don't know. Maybe maybe I'll do it on camera. I don't know. You guys, want me to do it on camera? Let me know. Okay, so this is the camp. Ow, 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 stop hurting me. I am allergic to pain. I've established that in the past. Stop, stop, stop. I'm trying to destroy, destroy your, your generator. All right, these things, oh. These are Patrick's things. They're like horns of some kind. There's no one. Come on! Thank you. Imagine doing this in real life. What else is this stuff? 
Yeah, if you press Z, we can see all of our awards. But the only award we got was Sand Slugger. We destroyed six uh, Sand Monster generators. I'll try to see if I can complete those two. Gives me time to build new stuff. Some driftwood, a few wires, some giant leaves. We can build anything we want. Yeah, that's Tux Roll. He just builds stuff here. All right, over there, there's uh, SpongeBob's house where you go to, to his bonus level. I must speak with you. Oh, shut up for a second. I'm trying to show everyone the campsite. There's a Statue of Liberty with Donkey Kong on it. I don't know why, why I chose Donkey Kong to be Statue of Liberty, but I'm cool with it. And then we should be where Danny's house should be somewhere. Let me see if I can find it. It's not that. Where is Danny's house? Oh, there's some more stuff for us. Oh, okay, can't go over there. Should be somewhere around here. I can't find it. I don't know. I'll find it later. So we, when we talk to the wise old crab, it'll take us to the next level. But though, I think that's a good place to end up the episode. So that's going to wrap things up here. So next episode, we're going to see what the wise old crab has to say. But for right now, it's time for me to hit the road. So that's going to be it for today's video. Did you like it? If you did, do me a solid and punch the like button below like a piece of dough. And if this is your first time on this channel, and you like what you saw, and you want to come back for more, Hit that subscribe button so that you can become a member of the Pizza Mind Mario Party today. Share the video with your friends, your boyfriends, your girlfriends, or whoever you want to share with. Hit that bell and turn on notifications so you can be the first one to see all coming videos. If you have a little bit of time, leave a comment. So until next time, this is your boy Mike, signing off. So, peace out y'all, and I hope you have a great rest of your day. I wonder why they didn't put Drew McIntyre in this game. I mean, he is the chosen one.